everybody, I just finished watching the last episode. Oh my god, I just finished watching season 2, episode 13, and oh my god, am I blown away. It was called uh, Happy New Year, baby. This is awesome. One of the best episodes I've ever seen. This goes back to the roots back in the day when they're all coming out of the family and all enjoy life. And this one was awesome. So it starts off with, um, <coughs> excuse me, something with DJ in the living room and she's waiting for Matt to come back from India and she's all in a hot dress and heels and then, then when Matt comes to the door, somebody comes to the door, she's like, lean on the chair, Matt, it's always open, and it opened, it was a freaking uh, postal man, or the UPS guy, or whatever they have on the show, delivering uh, um, Kimmy Gilbert's package, it was Kimmy Gilbert's package, and they're like, what? And he's like, what? He's like, golly, you're hot, this fucking, this, this, this guy was just all over her, you know, like, golly, she was smoking, you know what I mean, so, so then she's waiting again, and somebody else comes in, and it was Siege, CJ, and Steve, and then she turns, oh wait, before that, okay, she opens up the package, um, she opens up the package, it's a, it's a dress that, uh, from, it's from, um, Excuse me, it's from, um, Argentina. Then I guess, I guess Fernando wanted him to wear. And then she, she's like, it looks hideous, so. Okay, then she comes in. Um, then, then, yeah, CJ and D, DJ comes in, and then, uh, DJ, like, I want to propose. Like, I want to, want to propose? What? Wait. <laughs> Oh shit! She's like I wanted to propose. Oh, oh yeah, cause it all starts with yeah, I wanted to propose, and I was like, wait, what? Propose really? So then she 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 really has feelings for this guy, you know. She just has feelings for the guy for um for Steve. So then they play a trick, then they go to Max, and they're getting ready for New Year's, and they have a New Year's party with the little kiddos, and then Max got tricked that New Year's ended early for him, and he went to bed, and it was like not even midnight, yet, like 10 o'clock. And he's just nerd. okay, then, uh, okay, then, uh, Dan okay, Danny and all them come in the house, Danny, Rebecca, all them, D all them. And they're gonna have. They're gonna get their, their. They came here for the New Year's also, but also they come here and pick up their adopted kid. <laughs> I'm tired. They pick up their adopted kid, and it's um. So yeah, they stay here for the New Year's. They have Danny. All uh, them, and he brings Mister. Uh, then uh, Joey brings Mister. Woodchuck. He's like, "Hi, Happy New Year!" Obviously, doing the Woodchuck thing is hilarious. Very, very traditional Woodchuck. I love it. I love it. This New Year's episode was great. So then they show the guys in the backyard. They went to go walk Cosmo. They come back, sit down in the backyard, a couple of chairs, lit the fireplace, and they talk like men. And they're going to find out who will take care of the baby as soon as when they're gone. And they're like, Joey, you can. You can be the godfather. And he, he starts doing godfather re references. Doing Godfather like references, and um, then this is in there finding, Oh, I should be the dad. No, no, I should be the dad. 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 No, I think I should be the dad. So they don't know, we all don't know. Yeah. 
So we don't know. They don't know. So they're arguing, fighting, and Max is like, oh, that's the match with the bad news. He's like, they tricked me in Siege, and Steve come back, and the little girl comes, and then she goes in the match room, like, what's wrong? I'm like, I'm in a bed. It's like, not even midnight yet. So then they get up, and he gets up, and they trick him, they lock both doors, because he's like, are you, are you going to kiss, are you going to kiss Lola, and are you going to kiss uh, Popka, and then she goes, are you going to and they lock the door, got him, and then DJ comes up, okay, I'm going to lock, he's like, don't ever trick your brother like that again. And they go downstairs, and... They're getting ready for the new year, and they're still finding out who should be the dad. Then this happens. He's nervous as he's nervous as hell right now. Steve is nervous. You know, he's nervous. Like, what, 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 what do I do? What do I do? It's like, I don't know what to do. You know what? Like, what do I do? Like, like, so she, so, um, what is it? DJ's just trying to prep him up how, what to say for, for, um, for, for, uh, CJ, CJ. But before that, before that, Stephanie asked, asked Rebecca, I want to have a kid, but I can't have a kid. I can't get pregnant, whatever. So, like, okay. So she's about how the doctor thing going. So I go, go on. So they, so they, you know, putting the putting uh, the baby sacks, so just going the baby to sleep. <laughs> that baby is so cute in the show. I swear that baby is cute. But um, so they're still like, what they say, what they say. So then, then he has the ring. Then I hear the talk. And then I hear um, uh, Steve reciting it back to um. The, the DJ. And then guess who walks in the room? The food guy's here, like, oh, I guess you really don't let me think. Huh, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's not that. All frozen up and shit, like, can't talk. So then she walks in the room, like, hold on, hold on, I wanted to propose to you. Like, it's too late now. So he goes in there, stops her. He's like, wait. That's what they tell you. like, I don't know, I don't know. He's like, DJ. So DJ gets on one knee. She's still waiting for Matt to come. DJ gets on one knee, proposing. And guess who walks to that door as DJ's on one knee proposing to CJ? Matt. Da da da. <laughs> oh, shit. Matt comes into the door, right? Matt walks right through the door. He's like, what? He's like, he's like oh, and then after that, she says, Do you want to marry me? She said, yes. Yeah, and they're hugging. Like, I don't know, DJ was in the girl, so then, um, she gets out, like, no, no, it's for us, Steve. He's like, oh, I get it now. So then they hug, and they're like, oh, come down, people, come down. So they're about to ring in the new year. Then Max is like, my brother hates me, talking to, um, Jesse, Joey, and Danny. And uh, like, oh, they have you, like, I'm gonna give my brother a hug. So like, I guess we also give ourselves a hug. So Joey, Jesse, and all, then get, give them a hug. Then uh, Joey, you no, know, Jesse hugs Mr. Woodchuck and throws Woodchuck over the fence and into the pool. And then they finally go inside and they're all like, the three in the new year, come on, baby. Ball. And they're doing the countdown, five, four, three, two, one, all that good stuff. And, um,. Uh, so they ring on the new year, five, four, three, two, one. New year, happy new year, Fuller House. Um, so they all have a new year, all kissing, they're all, all kissing. Everybody is, Lola and Jackson kiss, DJ and Matt kiss, Stephanie and, and uh, Jimmy kiss, and then, but before that, she had Jimmy, uh, Stephanie told Jimmy, I can't, I can't get pregnant. Oh, me neither. He's like, me neither. Okay, so they're all kissing, everybody's kissing, and then uh, Max and them kiss, and then Lola, and then Popco and Ramona just clap hands until it's over. And they're like, yeah, I didn't really want, and then Popco, Popco's like, I really didn't want to kiss. So then Lola, then, uh, then Ramona lays a kiss on him, and that's basically it. That was it for this for that that part of the part of the ending of the episode. Then right at the end begins they they all they all fell asleep in the backyard. Everybody fell asleep in the backyard. Not everybody, but 
Let's see some of them. Let's see falling asleep in the backyard on the lawn chair as they wake up. With um with Jesse and Rebecca coming in with their uh, adopted child. They come in like, morning everybody, I got a gift. And it's like the adopted child and they're like, oh my god. You know, I'm like, oh, how cute. And, they're all, and then and then the three girls go to the side, you know, um, the three girls, uh, DJ Stephanie and, um, and Kimmy go to the side, they pull up the side, they're like, I don't know what to say, I don't know, you know, what do you do about, what do you do about Matt? It's like, I don't know, I really, really, really love Steve. It's like, I, I don't know, like, I really love Steve, you know? So she's like contemplating, I really love Steve. She's like, oh, hi, baby. And then that smile winks. And then they look at me like, let's, like, she will back. Ah, uh, woo. And they're like, quiet down, baby here. Scare the baby. Like, ah, uh, woo. And that basically ended it. Then, then the baby's like, come on. Ah, uh, woo, ah, uh, woo. And they're doing the wolf pack with the baby. She will pack. And that's the end of the Happy New Year episode. They do add a new episode. It's called Ring of the New Year. Tanner Fuller Gibbler style with a sparkling side in a house full of noise and a fun loving family that knows how to party. This is like a two minute video. It's called Fuller House and New Year's Eve Countdown. So I'm going to probably watch that. But I thank you guys for watching. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think about the last final episode. I can't wait. Season 3 is on its way. They did get the renewal. I'm excited. I can't wait. I'm like a kid that can't start wanting this season to start. But the final going to start until next year. And they have to write the storyboard, the scripts, everything like that. So they have to get all that done for the new for, for the new season. And I can't wait. What's going to happen with Matt and DJ? What's going ha to happen with Stephanie and Jimmy? You know, what's going to happen? What? You know what? Like, what what's the future gonna hold in those in the next season? Hold the deal at least four or five seasons. We'll see what happens. I can't wait. Don't really care if the Olsen twins are on there at this point. It's kind of it's kind of pointless. But if they do come, they better if they do come on the show. All of a sudden, like oh, I want to join now. Just for one one season, one episode. They better make it worthwhile because right now they're just pointless to the season, and nobody really cares. The Olsen twins are on there. So, but anyway, thank you guys for watching. Happy New Year, everybody. Enjoy your New Year. Go out there. Go celebrate. Go party. Go have some cider. And get the New Year started right. So leave in the conversation down below what you think about the episode. And also leave your comments down below. Hashtag resolution17. Tell me your resolutions. I'd like to know. And I always do my resolutions on my channel. Where I talk about what, what's coming for the New Year. So thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you all next time. Keep calm and watch Fuller House. Bye, y'all.